in this video let's try to find out the solution of this in equation right let's try to solve it uh, in the previous videos we had got a little bit easier questions and here a little bit uh, complex it is than the previous questions all right so uh, the first rule while solving uh, the any in, in equation is collecting all the variable containing term into the one side so here our variable containing term is this one and the, this one we need to make into the one side and all the constant and the numbers we need to keep into the another side so uh, first I'm writing this 2x minus 3 divided by 4 and I need to bring this variable containing term x containing term into the left hand side so it is plus and when it will come this side it will be minus so it will be minus 4x divided by 3 and equals to and greater than all right is equals to and greater than this is plus 9 I need to take it uh, take it to the another side that will be minus 9 all right and this 3 is initially from here so now uh, I have to do the simple uh, calculation here simple simplification I need to do so first let's take the LCM of 4 and 3 that is my 12 all right and then when 4 will divide this 12 I will get 3 so this 3 will multiply this 2x minus 3 similarly this 3 will divide this 12 so I will get here 4 that will multiply 4x and is greater than or equals to minus 6 further uh, it will be now 3 times 2 all right so it will be 6x 3 times 3 that will be minus 9 and this will be minus 16x divided by 12 all right is greater than or equals to again minus 6 and again here this is 6x and minus 16x so this is minus 10x all right divided by 12 and again minus 9 divided by 12 and equals to and greater than minus 6 so again we got a one constant term all right this constant term we need to shift into the another side so let's shift it so we'll get here now this is uh, we can cut by the 2 also if you want all right it's now minus 10x divided by 12 is greater than or equals to minus 6 by uh, sorry simply minus 6 plus 9 over 12 so it's now minus 10x over 12 is greater than or equals to now this will if there is nothing there will be 1 all right it's 12 so 1 times 12 that is minus 72 plus 9 all right and we can cancel this 12 and 12 now and we'll and now it is minus 10x is greater than or equals to minus 63 and now we are in such a stage we are in the standard stage all right like this ax is greater than or equals to b or maybe less than or maybe less than or equals to or maybe simple greater than so whenever we get in this stage we have to divide by the coefficient of the variable to the left hand side as well as the right hand side all right so it's minus 10x divided by minus 10 and it is minus 63 divided by minus 10 and whenever we divide or multiply by the negative number the sign get changed all right it gets reversed so here it is turning this side it's greater than or equals to sign now it will be less than or equals to sign because we know that whenever we multiply or divide by the negative number uh, into the left hand side and right hand side by the same number then the the inequality get reversed all right so this and this will cancel up and here it is x is less than or equals to this minus minus will cancel up you'll get 63 over 10 all right so it is 6.3 actually and if you see in the number line uh, if this is 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 all right so 6.3 will be somewhere here all right this will be this will be 6.3 or you can say 63 over 10 so here our solution is x is less than or equals to 63 over 10 so including this and all the number less than this 63 over 10 till this is negative infinity this is positive infinity so this is our this is our solution all the number all right which are less than 63 and in this negative infinity from negative infinity to till 63 over 10 and here is the big bracket I'm giving the closing bracket why I'm giving closing bracket because here is equals to sign all right so this is the solution of this uh, 